Hey, what's good, guys? This is Saf, or Fresh, whichever you want to call me. Um, today I have a, a video on this game, Friday the 13th, for you. And I will be showing you where all the good glitch spots are using the best glitch in the game, which I call the booty glitch, because you'll see why. But for now, I'm on Higgins Havens. I also will be showing you some um, from Packnack as well. But for now, uh, we'll just be entering the main cabin in Higgins Haven, and we'll just be going upstairs. Um, this is a really good glitch spot, and since unfortunately this uh, stair glitch was patched up, um, there's not really much you can do. You know, a lot of glitches were patched, sadly, and yeah. But for this one, uh, one of the best spots to do it is actually in this corridor area. You can access it through this room or the closet next to it. So first and foremost, you'll be locking this door and going over here. And you can open this window just to make it look less suspicious just in case Jason runs through that door or breaks it. Because if the door is locked and the window is closed, it looks kind of suspicious. But anyways, you'll be going in this corner and you'll be angling yourself so that your back is facing the corner. And then you're just going to keep crouching using circle or whatever else you use to crouch. And just keep doing that repeatedly until you go through the wall like this. And even right here is a pretty good spot just to like chill out. Um, it depends on what kind of character you have. If you have like a stealth character, you can just like sit up here crouched and Jason will have a pretty hard time finding you and even if he does find you you just like run back and forth and avoid his throwing knives or if you're just trying to troll and piss him off then make sure you have a spray and probably a character that has good strength versus you know stealth so if you wanted to head back up the stairs and into the same spot um, you'll see that the door is locked, that doesn't really matter, Jason will probably knock it down anyways, but you can access the same uh, glitch spot through this door in front of us that leads to the closet, or you could go back to the room that's locked, it doesn't really matter, but what I like to do is I like to lock the door because I don't want anybody bothering me, and remember to angle yourself correctly and just keep backing it up backing it up until you get through the wall completely so you'll probably have to look at yourself make sure your booty's sticking out whatever and just keep backing up until you get into the same room and then from here like i said you can either go into back into the closet or into the glitch spot in the back but we're gonna go to the second spot i want to show you guys which is well, actually right here, you can get in here too. You can do that. But the thing about this spot is that it's extremely, like, extremely small and you can't really move. So once you get in there, it's mainly just to hide in. Other than that, you don't really want to stay in there. But this right here, this is probably the best spot you can get into besides the last spot I'm going to show you in Packnack. But um, on this map, this is probably the best spot. So, as you guys know, uh, there was another glitch to get into this secret room here if you had a, a bear trap, but you don't need a bear trap anymore. If you just use this booty glitch, <laughs> you can be able to get in just easy. So, just do that, back it up, back it up, find your spot, whatever, and then eventually you're going to get into this tiny, small secret room. But, this room is actually very spacious, it's actually very, like, very hidden, and this is probably the best room to be in because you can run around jason can hit you through walls but he will not hit you through these walls because unless you're standing right by the wall which you're not going to be doing but yeah you could just stay in here chill in here till the cops are called or if you get bored you can jump out one of the windows over here or you can just angle yourself correctly and um, exit the same way you came which is with the booty so yeah that might be the best spot in the house um, but as for another spot on the map, I have one more for Higgins Haven, which is located out this way. And it's just this little shed over here. Um, this is a really good spot actually that I found because you could be like working on the boat over there and Jason could be like about to kill you. So you would just hurry up and run over here, use the booty, you know. And then you're pretty much safe once you're in this room. 
but like I said before, he can hit you through the walls, and this is a bit more small than uh, the last hiding spot, but as long as you stay in the middle, he's not going to be able to hit you, so you should pretty much be completely safe with this one. And yeah. And once you want to leave, this is like the easiest one to get back out of. So you just skirt, skirt, go, booty bump, and you're back out. Easy as that. So here we're on a map called Pakanak. And the spot I want to show you next is located in this main cabin. Um, this spot I'm going to refer to as the Harry Potter spot because I'm going to be going under those stairs. <laughs> And same as the other times, you're just going to angle yourself right and just back up that magic booty till you're under the stairs. And again, you might have to look around your body, just make sure your butt's going the right direction. And this is actually how it looks like from the inside. Pretty decent, pretty spacious. It's a pretty good spot all around. Actually, the only problem I've really found with it is that you can't really get back out the same way you came in. You're actually going to have to instead go to this corner um, and just squat, 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 twerk, twerk, twerk until you're finally in the bathroom next to it. Like this. So, yeah. That brings us to our final spot and probably the best spot of all the maps. And as some of you might know, uh, Pakanak used to have an outside the map uh, glitch which was right here you used to be able to just crouch 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 and then you would be able to go over the fence but they patched it so you're not able to get outside of the map supposedly but I found out that with this booty glitch you're able to come over here and you know just get by this wall and again angle yourself right it's actually really easy to do in this spot as well and just keep twerk 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 twerking and in no time you'll be on the other side of the wall in this barn that nobody was supposed to have access to and just like that the Pakanak patch is not patched anymore you can still get outside of the map as you can see um, you're still able to go everywhere you're, you were able to go before, under the river, on the other side of the bridge, all of that. And that actually looks like this. There's no actual water that you go in. It's just ground, but it looks like water. <laughs> but yeah. And as you can see here, we are clearly outside the map. Um, I'm going to run over this way though because it's actually cool to see the other side of the bridge you know where the police pick you up and everything and you can um, see that down this way but if you wanted to go back outside of the glitch just past this area you actually cannot do that it doesn't let you you can keep running and running and running you're not gonna be able to go on the other side but it's funny though because um, they can't kill you at all but you don't want to keep running this way at all because you will die. I tried it uh, just before this and I died because I ran too far. So yeah, once you're in this glitch, it's kind of fun to stay right here. You can just troll Jason. And again, you cannot enter the glitch in that spot anymore. It is patched. But if you use the spot I tell you to, you're able to enter this outside the map glitch again. But yeah, guys, that's it. Those are all the spots I have to show you for today. And let me know if you like the video. Um, let me know if you want me to keep making videos like this. Uh, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that. And yeah, thank you so much for watching all the way through. If you did, I really appreciate it. And yeah, I'll see you later. Bye, guys.